ഗുഡ് മോർണിംഗ് എവരി വൺ വെൽക്കം ബാക്ക് ടു അവർ എ എസ് എൽ ക്ലാസ് യൂണിറ്റ് ഫോർ ഫോർ ലെഗ് ഡിഫറൻസ് ലുക്ക് അറ്റ് പേജ് നമ്പർ ട്വൻറ്റി ഫൈവ് വാം അപ്പ് വൺ വർക്ക് ഇൻ പേഴ്സ് ലുക്ക് അറ്റ് ദീസ് പിക്ചേഴ്സ് ആൻഡ് ചൂസ് ആൻ ആനിമൽ യു വുഡ് ലൈക്ക് ടു ബി ടെൽ യുവർ പാർട്ട്ണർ വൈ യു വാണ്ട് ടു ബി ദിസ് ആനിമൽ റൈറ്റ് എ ഷോർട്ട് നോട്ട്സ് ഇൻ യുവർ റഫ് ബുക്ക് ഓൺ why you want to be this animal listen to the audio unit 4 listening listen to pranith and meena talk about the animals their grandparents have tick the correct answers as you listen to them before you listen read the questions in your book my grandparents live in the village with many animals mine too they have bullocks and a dog my grandparents have lots of cows cats and hens i like the bullocks they are big and strong and also gentle and friendly they do a lot of work plowing the field pulling the cart I like the cows best. My grandmother thinks they're her children. She has names for all of them. She milks the cows early in the morning. I get up early to go to the shed with her. Have you ever tried milking the cows? Yes, I did. Once last year, and I got a good kick on my chest. Ha, <laughs> you must have scared them. Of course not. They are very friendly and the cats are friendly too. They are very good at catching mice. Grandmother gives the cats fresh milk every day. Don't your grandparents have cats? No, they have a dog called Tiger. He's my grandfather's best friend. His job is to scare people off. My grandmother says she's never bored with so many animals around her. They're her family. My grandparents say the same. How amazing. After listening the audio, you should tick the correct statements in page number 25A and 26B. Now Listen to the audio. Get it right. Unit 4. Get it right. Listen carefully to these phrases. Do you hear both the words in the phrases clearly? Get up. Look after. In phrasal verbs like these, both words have strong forms and they are pronounced clearly. Listen and repeat these phrases. Take down. Put on. Carry on. check in find out get on try on give up you should listen to another audio listen and tell unit 4 listen and tell listen to this funny story about a parrot who outsmarts a cat then retell it in your own words anam's friend was going on a holiday for a few days He had a pet parrot 
and requested Anam to take care of it. Anam brought the parrot to her house. The bird climbed up to the top of its cage and looked at everything with its round eyes. Anam had a pet cat called Jim, who had never seen a parrot before. He thought it was some kind of a green hen. Jim walked quickly to the corner of the room. There he lay down and stretched out his paws. The parrot watched Jim all the while. Suddenly, Jim leaped onto the cage and tried to open it. At first, the parrot was too frightened to move. Then, very courageously, it squawked in a deep voice. Did you have breakfast? Jim fell back, terrified. How can this hen talk? He thought. And what did you have? Continued the parrot. That is not a hen. That is a man, thought the cat and hid under the bed. He did not go near the parrot after that. So dear children, that's the end of today's class. Thank you very much. See you.